guys, today I would like to share with you a product comparison. First, I produce a scale called Evo, a smart body fat scale. And I also purchased another scale called InBody Smart Body Fat Scale. This model is about 399 US dollar. And this model is about uh, 79.99. So what's the difference? Let's see. This model is with a very elegant smart uh, body fat scale. It's with an elegant gift box. So let's open what's inside the box. Wow, it looks very nice. So it's this scale with a smart body fat scale. So with a menu and a scale. And the scale also with a handle like this. So it's a very elegant body fat scale. Let's open the 400 US dollar in body body fat scale. So we will also have an instruction menu and we will have a scale. The scale is big. So maybe for the storage, uh, it's not so good. And it's very thick. So the smart body fat scale also with a handle installed in, into it. What's the difference between this one? And right now, I will do a real text between this model and this model. It's a smart body fat scale that connects with Bluetooth. It's very easy for connection. So let's see. So right now, it says that it's analyzing my body fat. It takes a time and there is a, oh, okay, it comes up, so let's see. So the app has all my data review, yes. So let's see, we have more, it's here. Right now, I am trying to connect the smart scale with the smartphone, but it takes really long time that the Bluetooth connection is so long to connect. So as you can see, it almost takes about 10 seconds. Okay, I, right now I stand on the scale. Okay, I think it's already done. Okay, let's see all the data information here, and later I will do the I will do the comparison. Hello guys, we already have a real text about this model, a black model smart body fat scale, and the in-body model. So this model is under one hundred US dollar, and this model is about four hundred US dollar. Both of them have smart apps. Now, right now, let's see the data information. From this app, we can see it's 136.2 pounds, and this one is 136.5 pounds. So for my body fat of this one is 27.4%, and for in-body, it's about 31.4%. So for the in-body, actually, it's more high body fat rate, and this one is lower body fat rate. So in comparison, I think they are quite similar, but which one is more suitable for you? Let's check out. Okay, from these two apps, we can see from InBody, their app is very simple and clear, only two weight numbers. But from our Apple's app, it's about all the information on the app. You can see all the body fat and body muscle on the scale, on the body. And here, there is a report. This is what amazed me. So a really detailed report, and it can print it out to print. I love it.